It's a lady in London here. Today I want to take you around on my self-guided walking tour of London's Spitalfields. This area is known for everything from its amazing street art to the vibrant markets on Brick Lane and lots of great shops and restaurants. I can't wait to show you around. My free self-guided walk starts at Liverpool Street Station. You can get here by train, bus, or on foot from other parts of the city. From the station, you'll walk up Bishop's Gate and then take a right on Brushfield Street. Soon you'll find yourself in Bishop's Gate Square. Bishop's Gate Square leads into Old Spitalfields Market. This famous covered market is a great place to browse and buy. There's everything here from clothes to food to vintage items. Once you're finished browsing at the market, you can make your way to Puma Court. This little street has beautiful almshouses, so make sure you take them in as you go by. At the end of Puma Court, you'll turn left on Wilkes Street, then turn right on Princelet Street. You'll start to see a lot of the historic, colorful buildings that Londoners love to photograph in Spitalfields. Your next stop is Brick Lane, one of the most famous streets in London. You'll walk along here for a short period, but don't worry, you'll be back later to see more. From Brick Lane, you'll take a left on Hanbury Street and walk down to Dray Walk. You'll be in a big courtyard here by the old Truman Brewery, and there's often markets and all kinds of action going on. Back on Brick Lane, you'll walk all the way up to Bethnal Green Road. There's a lot to take in here, from shops to bars and restaurants. Some days there's markets on too, so you can stop and take in all there is to see.
After retracing your steps down Brick Lane, you'll turn left down Hanbury Street. This street has some of the best and most famous street art in all of Spitalfields. Back on Brick Lane, you'll take in more street art, shops, and restaurants before you turn down a side street with colorful buildings to get to Commercial Street. Once at Commercial Street, you'll cross over where it's safe and then find yourself on Brushfield Street. You'll be back by Old Spitalfields Market now and you can take in the historic buildings beside it. At the end, you'll reach Bishop's Gate, where you can turn left, cross the street where it's safe, and end your walk at Liverpool Street Station. I hope you've enjoyed this self-guided walk and that it's inspired you to get out and do it yourself someday. As always, the route and map are on my blog, aladyinlondon.com, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel before you go. Happy walking.